Hi, and welcome to another video about how to use Draw Attention. In this video, we're going to look at how a realtor might use Draw Attention to make really spectacular layouts for apartments and homes. We're going to make one for 418 Norman Street. It's in Beverly Hills, so even though it's an apartment, it is one point, almost $1.3 million. And there's our apartment. But we want to show a layout where you can click on each room and see more information about it. So here in WordPress, under the Draw Attention menu, I'll click Add New, and we'll give it a title. I'm not going to use General Settings or the Highlight Styling right now. So the first thing we're going to do is pull in our image. And I've already uploaded it. It's right here. So now I click Save Draft, and now we can put in Hotspot Areas. Now they're already labeled, but we can put in much better information than this. Let's start with the master bedroom. It looks square, but it's not. There's a little jig jag here, so we're gonna use the polygon here. And I'm also going to zoom in a bit. Now I'll grab the polygon, and we'll start here. There we go, I actually did that wrong. So that shows how you can delete points and go back. Come to here, and then all the way over here. And then you click your first point to end or you can click Finish. Now we've selected the master bedroom. So let's put in our title. Master bedroom is a good title, but the real value is going to come in the description. And then when people click on this, we want some information in the right side. So let's edit our page and we'll put it right below this row. And there's a block for draw attention. And there it is. So now we'll update this page and then take a look at it on the front end. The interactivity doesn't work in the editor, but it will work on the front end. Now this is the title that we gave to our layout. And you'll note that our background here is gray. I'll show you how to fix those in just a few minutes. We click on master bedroom. It loads right over there. So obviously we need to make some changes for styling for fonts and things like that, or change our layout. I'll show you how to do both. But first, let's go add some more rooms. Let's add bedroom number two, because it is square, and we can do things like this. There we are. We'll update that. And then do one more room. Let's do the kitchen. There, let's click Update, and then we can reload our page without having to re-embed anything. And you can see there's the second bedroom and the kitchen. So let's change how this looks a little bit, because things like master bedroom are just too long. So we'll go back here, and let's go to General Settings. The image background color right now is this gray but the page is white. So let's set it to white, just like that. So let's click Update, now that we've made it white, and Reload, and you'll see that it looks less awkward laying on the white. Draw Attention does not have settings for the font sizes for these. However, that should come from your theme. You'll see that mine look better now than they did a few minutes ago. I used my theme, which happens to be Cadence WP, to adjust the size of this font. You can do that with your theme as well. But what if we don't want this over here on the side? Let me show you another way to do this. Over on the right, we're going to choose Lightbox and Update and reload our page. You'll note that the image is now in the center. And when we click, it brings up this modal box that dims the background of the screen and makes it much easier to see. One more thing you can do to make this look really great is add a photo to this pop-up. Let me show you how. We'll do the kitchen. And right down here is a field for a URL. But you can use this button to go to the media library and choose one there. And it drops it right in there. So now let's update. And reload our page. And now when we click the kitchen, 
we get this and it looks much nicer. So that's how you can use draw attention to bring a better user experience to people who want to explore your properties.